Hi, Bridget here with Made to Motivate, and today I wanted to talk to you about um, Beachbody and why it's not a pyramid scheme and what a pyramid scheme is um, compared to an MLM, multi-level marketing, and some common objections that occur and that I hear often when it comes to being a coach. So first of all, a pyramid scheme is um, when someone's at the top and there's people trickling down and all the money goes to the top. Um, there is no product to sell. Someone has an idea and they are selling that idea and people buy into that idea, but they receive nothing in return. And to get money, the people that are you know, following and trickling down, they must get other people enrolled to also buy into this idea of the person at the top. Um, that is a pyramid scheme and they are illegal. Um, a multi-level marketing, um, business is when you get products and you share those products with other people. So I do not personally have to recruit anyone as a coach to be a coach with me. Um, I share products and I get commission from those products and I can recruit if I want to, but it's not something I have to do. Um, being a coach, um, with Beachbody, you do not have to work the business at all. You can be a coach and just get the discount. And there's, you know, nothing that you have to do. You never have an obligation to do anything else. Um, with coaching, you can get a commission from products because we sell products. We help people stay accountable and that's our service to them, but they get a product, um, like Shakeology or a fitness program or the Beachbody performance line. They get that, um, and they use that themselves. So a product exchanges hands. Um, some common objections that come with coaching is I don't have enough time or I'm not a salesperson. Um, I don't have the ideal body yet. And I've heard all of those before. I've had all of those objections myself. Um, first of all, n most people are not salespeople in um, Beachbody, at least not in our team. Um, if you are a salesperson, you're probably not going to excel at this business because people... Um, when it comes to health and fitness, they want to hear your story. They want to know that you can relate to them and they want to know that you've been in the trenches with them. So what we do is we share our own stories. Um, I did not start Beachbody coaching when, you know, when I looked like this, I was still 40 pounds heavier. I was already on my own journey and I realized when I signed up to be a discount coach, which means, you know, I wasn't trying to, um, you know, get people to do the same programs as I was. I was just doing it myself and I wanted the discount on Shakeology. Um, when I first started doing that, I realized that me sharing my journey on social media at Facebook, um, people were messaging me privately and asking me what, what I was doing because they could see changes already. So I share my story and I share what I'm doing. I share my workouts. Um, and that's what other coaches that are successful do. We share our struggles and our triumphs with what, you know, whatever program we're doing, um, and our nutri nutrition, because we all know nutrition is a big part of living healthy lifestyle. Um, we also like when it comes to, um, having the ideal body, like I feel that now that I've done this for three years, um, and I'm pretty much at the size I want to be, I just, you know, we all never really achieve the ideal body. We all have something we're trying to, you know, work on at different times, whether it be, you know, losing weight or gaining muscle or toning different areas. Um, we're all focusing on something at one point or another. But um, I felt that when I was heavier, people actually that I didn't know would follow me and relate to me sooner than some people do today because they people that I meet today do not know my story or where I came from until I tell them. So they might um, have that mindset of, well, she is already thin. She doesn't understand my journey. She wouldn't be able to help me. But you know, that's why I have to share where I came from and where I'm going. Um, so you know, if you're on the journey now, people will follow you. They're, they wanna know what you're doing because there's so many people that they're not ready for their own journey until they see what works for someone else. They don't want to take that step until they know it works for you. Um, and then when it comes to time, there are so many people that are full-time coaches. Um, I'm sorry, or they are successful coaches with full-time jobs. Um, I have a person on my team that's a vice president at her firm. I have um, my upline coach who was a 
an accountant, a full-time accountant, and he quit his job to do full-time Beachbody. Um, lots of moms, working moms, stay-at-home moms. You know, you have to put in the time to do what you want to achieve. Like, if you want to make this work for you, you want to quit your full-time job, you want to be able to work at home, stay at home, be a stay-at-home mom, um, you know, it, the commitment, I think, to start out and be successful is committing one hour a day. Um, I think that's a great commitment when you start out. As you do want to work the business and and um, build a team, you there are other things that can add on to that hour. Um, for me, I personally work about... I think three to four hours each day. And then weekends are really iffy for me. I have my daughter um, when my, hus my husband works weekends and I have my daughter to myself. So um, it's not something I really want to do because I'm a mom and I want to be with her. So um, I choose my hours and um, I make it work with the crazy schedule that my family has. So um, I don't sit around and watch a lot of TV anymore. Um, I don't, you know, scroll through Facebook very often. That's not something that... Um, I, you know, so I gave that up so that I could become successful at coaching. So I hope that helps you with some of the common objections and understanding the difference between what a pyramid scheme is versus multi-level marketing. Talk to you later.